We are new pool owners. We've had this pool for nine months and we do all the maintenance ourselves. And so this pool cleaner is an important part of our process. And I want to show it to you. This is the Polaris 3900 Sport. And uh, I'm going to tell you some of the pluses and the minuses or the pros and the cons. And uh, overall, I'd say it's mostly, mostly pros. Okay, so the first thing I liked about it is it is a Polaris, which means it's got decades of uh, good reputation. And so that was important to me. I didn't want some knockoff brand. Second thing I like about it is this storage bag. It's really easy to come on and off and it's got double zipper. Uh, again, real easy to operate. And we ran this all winter long when all these trees were dropping leaves. And I don't think I even changed the bag every day. It was even during the harshest part of the, the leaf uh, falling. This was, this was keeping up pretty good. So I liked the fact that I wasn't just constantly chasing after this bag. That's a plus. And you just dump all the, the junk. We had a girls swimming party over here yesterday. And so we got all sorts of hair in here today. So we either don't have girls swimming parties or have one of these. <laughs> Other thing I like is uh, the speed and the vacuuming power seems to be pretty sufficient and actually maybe, maybe industry leading when I was reading through all the reviews and stuff, it sounds like it supposedly has the most torque and uh, a lot of speed. We run it three hours every night during the middle of the night. Uh, when it comes out, our pool is always clean, even during the leaf season, unless it was like a, a limb or something that wouldn't be able to be picked up, it's always clean. Uh, so yeah, we like the suction, we like the torque, we like the bag. Uh, I think all the other stuff is pretty pretty normal. I think they all have a tail. Uh, if there was one negative, uh, this foam on the tail uh, wears down. I've replaced it once, I believe, and I bought a dozen of them really cheap, like maybe really cheap. Uh, so you can look them up on Amazon. Uh, this will grab uh, hair and stuff, but I think the point of it is it sweeps around, grabs the corners and knocks stuff out and so uh, just gets it back to where it can get sucked up. So overall, the the pool cleaner is great. We've had no problems with it again, nine months. Uh, everything seems to be holding up. The tires have all their tread. Um, yeah, it's been great. So I'll just put it back together, throw it in the pool and then video it for you to take a look. These things are quite an expensive uh, investment. And so I want to get a good one. We've been really happy with this one. So hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it's a help plugs right into the wall. It's really simple. Uh, yeah, it's good. Like I said, we're nine months in, but it's, it's not been an issue at all. Like I said, we've had it for nine months and it has never gotten stuck. I did read that it has a reversing feature that if it does get stuck, it'll just go into auto reverse, which is pretty cool. But I don't know if it's the design of our pool and there's not things to get stuck on or if it's just really a great unit, but it has never been stuck and it works like a charm. We are really happy with this thing. It goes forward, it goes backwards and every once in a while it just pauses for a second, kind of floats, redirects and then turns back on. It sounds like it's, it looks like it has like a really cool little algorithm that, that uh, helps it not just hit the same spots over and over and over. Gets the deep end and the shallow end evenly. There you go, I didn't know I could do that. When it is time to disconnect it, like for a party or something, all you do is turn this counterclockwise and then it comes right off. We pull it away, get it out of the way so you're not looking at it, but typically we leave it running all year long or leave it plugged in all year long until there's a party. So yeah, super happy with it. 3900 Sport Polaris, check it out. If you have any questions, I'm sure there's plenty of YouTube videos out there to explain. Yeah, see right there, it's just kind of floated the surface. It does that occasionally, and then it re-engages. I think that just allows it to point in a different direction so that it gets the whole pool uh, evenly. There's a pool toy right there. It barely missed it, but we've not had anything get jammed in it either. It's been really great. Also real quiet. It'll have a booster pump on the unit. So our pool equipment's over there. And uh, there'll be a booster pump. You gotta have one of those.
I hope that was helpful. Have a good day.